Tamil Nadu gets its first genome sequencing and that to next gen lab and we are in this location at DFH and uh, here you could see the first component being the biosafety cabinet and here uh, we could see one of the technicians working with a pipette and buret. This lab has been set up mainly to make sure that the samples regarding COVID-19 variants could be uh, uh, sequenced and the result and data could be immediately verified and the result could be provided. These are the various components of it that you could see the pipettes and the vials on it. That's a centrifuge. In fact, since this is a next gen lab here, you have centrifuge which actually has its own. This is a kind of a, something called as a plate centrifuge. These equipments are used in these kind of like high tech labs. The next thing component we are coming over is called a qubit fluorometer. And this is actually a very minute and very precise uh, machine which is used to find the concentration of the RNA. These are actually being worked with a sample of virus of COVID-19. And what's happening here is that that COVID-19 virus's RNA is actually concentrated and the concentration is found and then you use this machine. This is called the RT-PCR which everybody in the world would know currently and this is a machine. Can you tell us what exactly is happening with these machines here? Actually we have uh, three machines. The three machines uh, plays a major role in library preparation. Actually we have various tests, adapter ligation and amplification, PUFA digestion. So these three tests, three stages will be done in these three machines actually. This is Quan Studio. So we will quantify the uh, amount of complementary DNA present in a sample. So once it is, this is the final stage, once it is set up, then the samples are transported to ion chip. Right. So what's happening is that a strand of DNA gets an exact copy of it. That's called a complementary DNA and that sample is then moved into this particular lab and there you could see this is the lab where you have the most important components that is an ion chef you have the gene sequencer ion uh, machines over here and these are the machines here the samples are kept and that particular system on the right side that system is a very important uh, aspect at this point what is happening inside this system is that uh, 120 samples can be analyzed at one point and what happens from there is that within a period of four days results can be provided this is a very important setup in Tamil Nadu because by this we are reducing the time that is lost due to transportation and immediately any kind of variant can be discovered. In fact, in the like, second wave and the first wave, there were several different, different variants. We had the Delta variant, Delta plus variant. So taking note of it, Tamil Nadu government has set up this particular lab to make sure that any cluster formed anywhere immediately, that cluster can be identified whether if it is a new variant and how to handle it. And not just that, this actual lab can also handle Nipah, but they claim that since it requires high security for now, there is no necessary for it. But if time I mean, uh, needs, if there is a need coming up, that can also be done. So this is the high-tech lab that has been set up in Tamil Nadu, the first one to sequence genes and immediately get results. So in this lab, for now, the capacity is 800 samples per month and if required, more can also be created. But this is a next-gen high-tech lab that has been created in Tamil Nadu. With Virijan's Divyan, Pramod Madhav, for India Today.